เนี้ยใส่เส้นแต่งเลยเรื่องเรื่อง No government can ever attain legitimacy without free, honest, and orderly elections conducted and supervised by a trustworthy, credible, truly impartial, and independent commission on elections. We believe that the government and the opposition are charged with historic responsibility to speed up all efforts towards political normality. The Filipino must return to the traditional mode of achieving national consensus through the ballot and not through the bullet. Against the advice of my family and well-meaning friends, I am willing to return to Manila to serve as presidential campaign manager if Mr. Marcos will allow me freedom of movement during the campaign period, or at the least, unhampered access to our people through the media from my cell should he choose to return me there. Our country has not had meaningful elections for the last 12 years, and uh, we are hoping that this is The first step to return us to political normalities, I pointed out, where we can now all unite. Because if we can have an election that's free, honest, and orderly, then all of us will have to follow the winner and accept the verdict of the people. But so long as you do not have a credible election, then everybody will be questioning the legitimacy of government. And at the rate these insurgencies are developing, in fact, you will note last year, urban guerrillas already started in Manila, and uh, we are hoping that through this peaceful means. We will be able to appeal to our countrymen who would now go into the road of violence to please desist and wait and give this a last chance. Now, if we still cannot hold peaceful, orderly elections under Mr. Marcos, then we are afraid that the more radical elements in our community, those who are now already inclined to the use of violence because they have lost all hope in peaceful means, might just go ahead with their plans and then break our country asunder. For a man who has been in power for 16 years, with the entire military and government resources and personnel at his command, Mr. Marcos should so show self-confidence, even nobility, by giving the opposition a sporting chance. After all, it is Mr. Marcos who wanted this election. It is he who needs legitimacy. He says he needs a fresh mandate because, according to him, he was never really elected president or prime minister of the Filipinos. <laughs>